Rod Front is a moon orbiting the fifth planet in the solar system. It is the fifth inhabited body in this solar system. This is the planet that Arianne, Issa, and Falk all lived on during their teen years, as well as being a planet that is of the focus of the nation's expansion. During the events of Signalis, we visit several different locations on Rot Front. So the, over the course of this video, I will cover each of these locations as an intro to covering the deeper lore of Rot Front. So with no further Further delay, let's get into this, bro. First up is Block Sector C, which is the name of the area of Rodfrum we explored during the Rodfrum level that occurs during the final chapter of the game, bro. Rotfront Interplanet <laughs> Section 6 is the name of the radio station that was once operated by Arion's mother, which we visited during the Attorney Play First Person segment. Bro, this small radio station featuring a large nearby antenna array that it coordinates with. The station is most likely where Arion spent most of her childhood, seeing as it where her mother worked. This station also showcased a small bunker next to it in the memory, which is, is unknown if this bunker existed in the actual station, which is to wait for us to exit the memory. If it did exist, then it suggests that perhaps one of the down in the bunkers in the events of a particularly bad snowstorm. Next mid location is the Mandelbrot Polytechnic Obo Shoal. Mandelbrot <clears throat> Polytechnic Oberschul is the name of the school that was once attended by Arian, Issa, and Erica and what that we observed during Issa's flashback. This school, named Mandelbrot Technic Polytechnic High School, suggests that it was specialized in engineering, technology, applied science, and natural sciences, perhaps suggesting that the nation had a focus on these ideals rather than more artistic showings. From here, we can cover the Rutford Metro. Bro. Reptiles seem to use a great number of trains to travel amongst the planet. We see the inside of one of these during the train in the train cutscene. The metro seems to come at various locations on the moon, as well it seems that Arianne used it to get around from her apartment in Sector C to the school. And perhaps, in some theories, even took from the radio ray to Sector C. The metro can also be seen in the lower levels of Sector C that Esther explores during the area in the game. We should also mention some general lore about Rotfront, bro. On Rotfront, there's a deep folklore regarding the Red Eye, this referring to the Red Eye on Jupiter. They believe it to be a symbol of the surveillance of the nation and the ever-watching eyes of the Protector Corps. On Rodfront, they celebrate a holiday known as Monfest. However, this holiday would be put on a hold as you visit Sector C, either due to the infection or due to the Protector Corps' attempts to locate the spy. During Monfest, they will gift each other Russian marks, the nation's currency dipped in red. Formerly, this symbolized the blood of the revolution, but there are also connections to the red eye suggested by some. We will conclude this video with a quick reminder of the content regarding Rodfront. Bro. The memorial is a cutscene that has the tag Rot, which indicates it's from Rotfront. The memorial scene depicts a massive concrete version of Falk, or the revolutionary as well as a large tower flanked by radio raising buildings, suggesting it was built <clears throat> within the more urban parts of the moon. But with that, we've now covered the basic lore of Rotfront, with, with some intentions to cover them more in depth in the future videos. This video just serves as a nice introduction to the lore of the more major planets in the game. But if you'd like to talk to other Signals fans about the lore, or just in general, in this video's description, Chris has posted his main Discord VL cell, where he'll be discussing theories and lore regarding to the rest of the game as we've been to March forward. So hopefully some of you guys come over. With that, this has been Yanya, and I'll see you maybe.